Welcome to Conversations Live. For more than a decade, we've brought you the best in books, entertainment, celebrity interviews, and current events. When the movers and shakers of the world have something to say to you, they say it to us first. Here's your host, Cyrus Webb. And welcome back, everyone, to Conversations Live. I'm your host, Service Webb. Glad you all could join us once again. But for our radio audience here in Mississippi at WYAD 94.1 FM and WYADonline.com, we're glad that you all could be with us. Also, tuning in through our friends at iHeartRadio and Amazon Music Podcast. We're glad you all could be with us as well. Well, if you guys have stepped outside, you know that summer is almost here. We're already feeling the effects of it. And many of us, including myself, are already planning to do some outdoor entertaining in the coming months. But joining us now to discuss some fresh ways to personalize personalize and style your outside space. We're excited to welcome design expert from the hit Netflix series Queer Eye, Bobby Burke, to our program. He's going to share with you guys some great tips and let you guys know what Shutterfly is doing to help you get you guys ready. Bobby, thank you so much for the time. really appreciate it. Of course. My pleasure, Cyrus. Thanks for having me. Yeah, the pleasure is definitely all ours. Let's begin by talking about trends. What are some of the top trends you are seeing when it comes to backyard decor this year? You know, one of the favorite things that I love doing, and I'm starting to see even more now that we're all able to go out and have friends over, is kind of bringing your indoors out, you know, not being afraid to bring things like outdoor pillows and fabric napkins and um, non-disposable plates. You know, it's much more environmentally friendly as well. Um, what I usually do is I find a great color palette that I already have going on in my house, and I create that in my outdoor pillows and napkins. And that way it kind of makes an extension of your indoors, outdoors, and makes your spaces feel even more bigger and more expansive. Um, and you can create those really great moments by mixing up different patterns on your pillows. You know, I like keeping in the same color scheme but using different patterns. So I usually head over to Shutterfly because they have thousands of different patterns from tons of independent artists. And you can put those on pillows and your melamine plates and paper napkins. And it really makes a great cohesive feel that you can also reuse for every party and you don't have to throw them away. Well, that is a great tip, and it's great to see how Shutterfly is able to help with that. So, Bob, I want to ask you, I mean, when it comes to sharing tips for hosting the perfect outdoor get-together this year, what are some of the tips you have for our audience, especially for those that may be new to hosting get-togethers? You know what? I always say it's, lighting is one of the most important things. You can make any space look really chic with the right lighting. I've made a many a dingy balconies in New York or ratty backyards where I've lived before look super cool at night, which is in the South, obviously, where, when we all want to have ortho parties when it's much cooler. So yeah. get yourself some string lights. And don't be scared of electrical because there's so many of them now that are just solar powered. So you don't even right. need to worry about having a plug outside. You string them along your fence or in your trees or on the back of your sofa even outside. And it just creates such a great mood. Um, also, flameless candles are a really great way to create some ambiance. It's all about creating the ambiance and making your spouse, your spouse, well, making your spouse look great too, but making your space um, <laughs> <laughs> look really chic and inviting and making people want to stay the whole evening or until it's time to kick them out. <laughs> well, Bobby, uh, great tips for our audience. Last thing I want to ask you, then we're going to remind our audience where they can get more information. Uh, on a personal note, I mean, you have been able to do so much in your career, and you are living the, the dream that so many people have when it comes to being able to not only be able to find their own personal style but also help others. What has that been like for you to be able to do what you love and to see the impact it's been able to have on others you know it's been it's been amazing you know like you said to be able to do your job that you really enjoy doing and that has an effect on people you know a lot of people don't think of design as something that affects your well-being your mental wellness your mental health but it it really is so to be able to watch my craft help transform people's lives has been really really rewarding we definitely appreciate all that you do. Again, everyone, Bobby Burke has been our guest. You guys know him not only as a design expert, but also one of the stars of the hit Netflix series, Queer Eye, giving you guys some great tips when it comes to outdoor entertaining this year. Uh, Bobby, we mentioned it earlier, but where can our audience go for more information? Um, you can head over to Shutterfly.com. All right, Bobby. Thanks again. Congratulations on all your success and looking forward to our next chat together. Thank you, Cyrus. You too. I'll talk to you soon. 
All right, then. We thank your audience for tuning in to another great segment of Conversations Live, part of our News You Can Use segment here at WYAD 94.1 FM and WYADonline.com. Until next time, I'm your host, Cyrus Webb, saying, as always, enjoy your day, enjoy your life, enjoy your world. Thank you all for choosing Conversations Live. Now let's go make today amazing.